Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Ashley. I also go by Ash War and Ash War Plays over on TikTok. And first, I wanted to say thank you so much for 2,000 subs, which is absolutely crazy. And I'm so thankful for every single one of you guys. So we're starting this episode right where we had left off. Mimi is currently at Dirk's apartment and she'll be hanging out with Dirk until he leaves for Delso Valley. Harvest Fest is in a few days, so he's going to be spending it with his dad. And Mimi will also need to get back to her place to get ready to go to Brindleton Bay for Harvest Fest as well. And so we have a few events planned in Brindleton Bay. The first is Mimi will be going to the pumpkin patch with her girlfriends and they'll spend the whole day there. And then the next day, Mimi will go to her parents' house and celebrate Harvest Fest with them. <laughs> okay, so it's Wednesday morning and Mimi just got up and uh, Dirk is downstairs making them breakfast. So I'm gonna have Mimi come down here and eat it with him and then hang out with him for a few hours. Oh my gosh, y'all, they're so cute. They are so cute. Um, let's see. Let's brighten his day. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no. Mine, Zorpel Hitch. Oh, Whoopi Gorge. He's in a row. Mm -hmm. What is he asking? Oh, Oh my gosh, y'all, look at all these buffs that she has. Oh my gosh, Harvest Fest is tomorrow. Okay. First kiss. Good holiday. Cozy fire. Nicely decorated. Lover's comfort. Are you joking? Oh. Oh my gosh. He asked gosh i cannot i cannot believe this dirk dreamer <laughs> okay dirk dreamer wants to take things to the next level will mimi be his girlfriend yes we're going to say yes this time <laughs> new partner oh my gosh y'all look how happy he is oh my gosh he's so adorable <laughs> Dirk just became the boyfriend of Mimi, so now it's official, you guys. They're officially dating. Oh my gosh. What is he asking? Since he cooked, I'm gonna have Mimi clean up. Like, y'all, look at this view. I will never get over this. Okay, I think I'm gonna have them... Enjoy this nice ass pool Dirk has. Um, swim with Akira. Ariana, what are you doing here? Okay, we're gonna swim with Dirk. Y'all, I did not expect Dirk to ask Mimi to be his girlfriend again so soon. Oh my gosh. Okay, it's 2 o'clock and she's supposed to be heading to um, Brindleton Bay soon, so unfortunately we're gonna have to say bye to Dirk and head back to Mimi's place. Aww. Okay, so now we're gonna head back to Mimi's place to get ready to go to Brindleton Bay. Y'all. Y'all. Oh. <laughs> oh my I figured word would spread fast considering that Dirk is a celebrity. Nathan said, I heard you and Dirk started dating. Congratulations on landing a new boyfriend. We're gonna say thank you. We're gonna say thank you. Oh my gosh, Paige is calling. Hey Mimi, Gerald Ledford has asked me out on a date. Should I say yes? Um, I do not know who that is. I'm just gonna tell her to go for it. Okay, so I have Mimi's suitcase and Princess Carrier ready, so I'm gonna put this in her inventory. I'm also gonna put Princess's food and water bowl in her inventory as well. And now we're gonna head to Brindleton Bay and meet her girlfriends at the pumpkin patch. 
All right, you guys, so we made it to the Brindleton Bay pumpkin patch, and as always, I will have the lot on the gallery for you guys to download. Um, I'll give you a quick tour of this pumpkin patch. As you can see, there's an entire field of pumpkins for your sims to choose from. There's also several pumpkin carving stations as well. Inside the barn, there is a bar, and there's also bathrooms. And in the back, there are two llama pins. And as you can see, there's a llama right here. There's also a skating rink. And then there's a flower shop as well as a food stand. And yeah, this is the pumpkin patch. I think the most vital packs you'll need for this is the cottage living expansion pack, the spooky stuff pack, seasons. And I think that's it in order to be functional. You'll need the toddler stuff pack for these lights the wedding pack for this flower shop. And yeah, it's so cute and I had so much fun building it. Okay, I'm gonna get Mimi to uh, feed this llama. Oh, oh my gosh, let's hug the white llama. Oh. And then let's hug this one as well. Oh. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna have Mimi wash her hands and then it looks like she wants to drink a glass of nectar, so I'll have her order that at the bar. Okay, I'm gonna have Mimi harvest some pumpkins. All right, and then I think I'm gonna have Mimi order some food at the food stand. We're gonna get a carrot cake cupcake. Oh my gosh, it's getting dark. Oh, she got a buff from hugging the llamas. Y'all, look how cute this is! Oh my gosh, Penny fell! Oh, Paige fell! I am obsessed! Oh my gosh! Okay, so once they get done skating, we're gonna head over to Mimi's parents' house and the girls are gonna head back to San Shuno. All right, so we made it to Mimi's parents' house. Oh, it looks like LJ needs to go on a walk, so Mimi's gonna go walk him real quickly. So we're in the Howard household. Here's the one eating some popcorn. And here's Janet and you can't probably tell, but Janet is expecting you guys, and it may or may not be a girl. Aww. Aww. So yes, Janet is expecting one girl, and I'm going to need help picking a name for Mimi's little sister. So please be sure to leave a name suggestion in the comments below. It's 12.30 at night, so we're going to go ahead and head to bed. Okay, so we have a few things planned for Harvest Fest. The first is I want Mimi to go to the workout room and uh, do a little bit of yoga. She hasn't done yoga in quite a while, so we're going to do that first thing in the morning. And then I'm going to have her and Lamont cook a grand meal for Harvest Fest. Today is going to be filled with lots of wholesome activities. Oh my gosh, she needs to pee. I also should have had her take a shower last night. We'll just do it now. Okay, so here are the activities for Harvest Fest. The first is Grand Meal. The next is Thankful Spirit, which Mimi ignores because she is materialistic, which I think is so sad. Um, drinking, which Mimi loves because she's a foodie, and telling stories, which I think is very fitting because we need to tell Mimi's parents that um, Mimi has a boyfriend now. And not just any boyfriend, a celebrity boyfriend. Um, so she'll tell them over the grand meal later on today. But we're going to have her go to the gym and do some yoga. 
Oh, it looks like Janet's leaving. She must have worked out early this morning. Okay, we're gonna do a yoga routine. Let's do an energy centering. Oh, shoot. Okay, no, before she does that, we need to get these tasks done from working from home that we did not do yesterday. So the first task is to level up our writing skill, and then the next is to update our social network profile twice. So I'm gonna have Mimi come here and practice her writing skill real quickly. Girl, go right back up them stairs. Thank you. Oh my gosh, she has like an hour to do this. I completely forgot about this. Oh my gosh, period. That took like five seconds. Okay, um, update social media status. Okay, I think we'll get this done in time, guys. Oh, it looks like LJ needs to go outside again. What is Lamont doing? Okay, period. We got the task done. Let's go take LJ on a short walk. Let's go walk LJ. Oh, I missed him and his little buff bark. Okay, Mimi has come back from her walk with LJ and I'm gonna have her eat some oatmeal real quickly because she is starving. Oh my gosh, y'all, look how cute Mimi's parents are. Okay, it looks like Mimi has gotten some money from her videos. She has 106 simoleons from her beauty review video, 168 simoleons from her happy vlog video, and 125 simoleons for her beauty tips video. It looks like she's enjoying her oatmeal outside. Okay, so we're finally going to do some yoga now. Oh my gosh, y'all, look at Lamont. Okay, we're going to do an energy centering routine. I guess Mimi got her love for Jazz from her dad. You won't believe it, Gerard Ledford is such a sweetheart, I'm in love. Again, I have no clue who this is, so I'm just gonna say congrats. Oh, it looks like Mimi got a buff from it. Just call me Cupid from hooking up other Sims. Okay, so while Mimi does her yoga routine, I wanted to talk about her aspiration because I don't think I've ever touched on it. So she currently has the inner peace aspiration and some tasks that she needs to do in order to complete this aspiration is practice mindfulness, seek relaxation and find peaceful surroundings. And I think this aspiration ties really well into her love of traveling. Okay, it looks like she's cooling off now. Oh my gosh, y'all, princess is so adorable. So now that she's done with that, we're actually going to uh, check on the chicken coop. Okay, I'm gonna have Mimi come over here and feed the chickens. Oh my gosh. Look at Big Daddy. They are so adorable. Okay, we're gonna collect those eggs. Let's see how many we got. Okay, so it looks like we have collected seven eggs. And then now we're going to clean the chicken coop. Oh my gosh. Y'all, look at Princess. And as soon as she got here, they went right into their coop. Okay, so it is getting a little bit later in the day. And so what I'm gonna have Mimi do is cook together with Janet and Lamont. And we're going to cook a turkey dinner. Rasha, Ludrif, <laughs> Yumba. Okay, so I guess they're just going to watch Mimi cook this meal. Okay. Alright, so the grand meal is cooked. No thanks to Mimi's parents. So now I guess it's a good time to tell Mimi's parents that um, Mimi has a boyfriend. Is there an option to do this? Oh, we can enjoy company. Okay, let's do that. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Let's be thankful. Yana, I've brought the plants. 
Let's be thankful to Mimi's mother as well. Can we tell them about dirt? Like, is that an option? <gasps> no! Princess, no! Are you joking? Are you joking right now? Mimi! Okay, Mimi's mom said something. Oh my gosh! Mimi, I need you to lecture your cat. You're hissing? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Here, Mimi. She already ate off of it. Okay, just clean up. Ugh. I was really hoping that Mimi would take some leftovers home, but it looks like Princess ruined that for us. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna have Mimi clean up. Dang, I was really looking forward to those leftovers. So it looks like Mimi's parents called it a night. It is 11.30. And so I'm going to have Mimi stay over at her parents' house for the night. And then tomorrow morning, we'll head back over to San Myshuno. Oh, she needs to pee. Okay, um, we're working from home. Ooh, it looks like it's night on the town. Free food and drinks. Period. I know what we're going to be doing tonight. I don't know why everyone came to Mimi's room. But, um, you guys, it's snowing again. Oh my gosh, y'all, she is showing. They are so cute. I think Mimi is going to head home now, so I'm going to have her say goodbye to her parents. Don't know why they're going in the bathroom, but she's going to hug her mom. Okay, and now she's going to hug her dad. Oh. And hopefully, the next time we come visit Mimi's parents, Mimi's little sister will be born. So that'll be so exciting. Oh, it looks like we got a sentiment with Janet. Oh, it looks like we have an adoring sentiment. Mimi just wants the best for Janet and thinks she is so wonderful. Oh my gosh. That is adorable. Okay, you guys. So we're going to head back to San Shuno now. Mimi has made it back home from Brindleton Bay, and I have her eating some leftovers. And while she's doing that, I'm going to put away the pumpkin she harvested at the pumpkin patch and the eggs she collected from the chicken coop. I'm also going to put away her luggage in Princess's carrier, and then also put the laundry away as well. Y'all. Y'all. Are you joking? Are you joking? Girl, come over here and pound on this door. Victor, we do this every day. We do this every single day. Why are you being like this? Like, at this point, bring Vanessa out here so I could talk to her too. We're yelling at him. I'm not complaining anymore. We're just gonna go straight for it. Chab uh, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, y'all, we're in the red with him now. Oh my gosh. She does not like Victor, y'all. Girl, do not talk to him. Go back to your apartment. Okay, you guys, so we're going to end the episode here. I apologize if it's a little bit more shorter than my other videos, but that's because I've already planned the next two videos out and I need to do a lot of prepping for these videos. Plus, I will be going out of town in a few days, so I wanted to make sure I got a video out to you guys before I leave. But as I said before, Mimi's little sister will be born soon and I'm going to need a little help naming her. Um, a few things to point out is that Mimi's real name is Marie. She was named after Lamont's mother, Mary. So maybe Mimi's little sister can be named after Janet. Maybe have a name that starts with a J. Um, I'll let you guys come up with the names and I will pick my favorite one in the comments. But yeah, I just want to say thank you again for 2000 subs. I really do appreciate the support. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment. And I will see you all in the next video.